say, but who's going to come out on top? Well, here we go. It's one of the game's greatest rivalries between the two most successful clubs in English football. I'm Guy Mowbray, joined for commentary by Sue Smith, and Old Trafford is alive with expectation ahead of Manchester United against Liverpool. Oh, what a game this promises to be. Two really successful teams over the years, and you think United have the advantage of being at home, but the away fans are certainly making themselves heard. I can't wait for this one. Here's how Manchester United line up. Andre Onana is in goal. Diogo Dallo plays with Luke Shaw in the fullback positions. Scott McTominay plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And they'll play with a lone striker up front. This is the Liverpool starting lineup. Alisson is in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside. Real opportunity. Oh, he tried to power it in. That's flown wide. Absolutely flown.
Jones. Well, here we can see it again, and he shows great ability to get past his man. And as soon as he's through 1v1 with the goalkeeper, he just goes for power and smashes it in the net. It's a quality finish. And that will do it for the first half here at Old Trafford. Well, he's made his mark on the game, proving particularly hard to play against. He's causing problems. Yeah, and I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled that into them, you know. Keep focused and keep playing through to the whistle. And it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Second half kicks off with Manchester United needing to turn this game around. Real opportunity. Brilliant work by the man in goal. That's a top stop. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Good job done to keep it there. to the near post. Oh, it's still in there. Kenta looks on here. Options available. Nice pass, and on they march. Oh, a great chance. Well, that's what he's there for. It's a good stop. play. On he goes, terrific. Can he finish? Oh, that's not properly away. Pass cut out, what can they do now? Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to probably stop that.
Rashford. Rashford. Looking to put the cross in. Surely the equaliser. And it's in. The goal to get us back to level pegging. Well, here's the replay. Despite lots of pressure from the defender, he manages to hold him off, gets his shot away. It's a good goal, that. So it's one each as the game restarts. Savos line. Robertson, Alexis McAllister, Virgil van Dijk, it's good strong play, a really good interception to take the ball, still trying to find the space, and just wide of the mark, goal kick. Yeah, the keeper seems to have it covered. Not bad effort, though. Well, here's the replay, and he's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, and then it's quite the finish too. Struck with real venom, and that's what makes it difficult for the keeper. And away we go again at 2-1. Misplaced. Some chance this. Oh, superb save. He's done so well to keep that out. against putting it in that's across the line it'll be a throw in move as they seek that equaliser. 
into the box. Ross just cleared the bar. His movement's good, isn't it, to find space and then connect well. Just can't quite get it on target. And away we go again at 3-1 now. Bruno Fernandes. Pass was red and the ball has changed hands. Anthony. Well, that's what he's there for. It's a good stop. There is the final whistle. Plenty of positives for them to take away, not least the three points, Sue. Well, I thought they deserved to win the game, didn't they? They played some really nice stuff. I thought they dominated the midfield area and the work rate was excellent. It's a great result, that. There have been a few good performances out there today, but of all the players on show, he's one that's really caught the eye. Well, he'll be buzzing about the result and his goal, I'm sure.